guys, today it's the second of the month, at least for Oceanic servers, so that means there is a whole new inventory in the trading post for March, so if you'd like to see what's on offer, then please keep on watching. Let's Anything you want, I pick hope. up my initial 500. Okay, so this month we have the Sky Captain's Formal Attire. Which actually looks pretty cool indeed. You can see all the items over here. Then we have the Skyborn Blades. That actually looks pretty cool as well. There's only a slight variation when you go between them. This one's more glowy and this one is without the glow. Catastrophe's Edge is a two-handed sword. Not really a fan of that one though. Then we have a Sword Corroded or Gari Defender. Delicate Jade Parasol. Why can't I see it then? Oh, it's a toy. Pull out a fancy Jade Parasol for 15 minutes, allowing you to safely float down the next time you fall. Okay, well that's not something I necessarily need, but... One, it's a toy, so... Yeah, alright. Parasol. I think I will buy that for now. Ooh, no delay this month. Oh, that's a plus. Also, I like the new green umbrella. Oh! That reminds me, I bought it, but I haven't tried it. For Jade? Oh, there we go. Here. Pull out a fancy Jade parasol for 15 minutes. Oh, that's nice. Oh. What was that? Oh, falling speed reduced. Okay, so that's good. You can angle it like the other stuff, like the little welt pet or transformation. Oh, that's a little scary when it reduces the speed. That is cool. I like that. Definitely good if you don't have levitate or something. Oh, and when you land, you still have it? Oh, that's nice. Cool. Alright. What was I doing? Hit battle. Yeah. Oh! Even on the mount, you keep it. Nice. You've got my ear. Surviving means being resourceful. Oh, that's a nice touch. Fancy. And oh, here we go. Two masks coming up. So, this is the guise of the Royal Masquerade, which has white feathers and a purple gem. This one has a blue gem with bluey purple feathers. Guise of the Shining Masquerade. Then we have the Jeweled Ripper. Yeah, this one. Month is definitely a melee type of inventory. So jeweled rippers. They're um pretty big for fist weapons. But I guess that's what you want if um you want to do a lot of damage. Virulent gavel. Hmm. 
Hmm. Yeah, I'm not really a fan of that either. Black Rock Executioner. Well, that's pretty huge, but it is a pole arm, so I guess it makes sense. Gossamer Teal Gown. Okay, yep. These, I've said before, I'm not really a fan of because I prefer the original versions. They're just more intricate looking. So, yeah, I don't see myself getting any of these. Plainer looking tabard. These definitely look nicer than the guild tabards, I have to say. So if you could just plop on your little emblem in the middle there, I think they would look a lot nicer than um, what we have at the moment, although it's been a long time since I've actually used any of my tabards, or guild tabards, that is. Here we go with the green versions of the Hooded Cloak. Ensemble Vagabond's Aquatic Threads. Yeah, so I don't use the hooded versions, but I do like buying these ones. Oh, that's pretty nice. Yeah, so that's a definite yes. And then we have the flowing aquatic gloves, which I don't normally buy. As well as the sarongs. I don't normally buy any of these either. In two colours. These I'm quite interested in though. So. Wait, where's the pet? Oh, is that the um, reward for filling the bar? Here's the green version of the Duelers Aquatic Shoulder Cape. And the cloudy shoulder cape. I do like those. So I'll probably lock that in. Over the crown that I had last month. A lot cheaper too. Hey, there we go. Chipped war blade. Basic looking weapons. I actually don't mind those. They actually look quite good with this set, actually. So that's 50. You know, if I had more tenders, I would probably buy it. But, yeah, you can see I'm pretty low at the moment, or very low. And the Regal War Cloak, which I actually don't mind. It does kind of remind me of Avatar. Like the new series that's come out on Netflix, which I loved by the way. I've binged I've binged the whole thing twice so far. So the returning stuff not really a fan of these monochrome models. Fellforged Fell Fang. Hmm. It's not too bad. Oh, here we go with another crown. Lost Crown of the Arcane. I don't normally buy the crowns either, but I do like the fact that it doesn't hide the hair since the whole head isn't covered. Mephistroth's Razor. One-handed sword. It's definitely pretty colourful. And this one, I do remember seeing this one. Fabulously flashy finery. Wow, I don't really like much at all. I'll be seeing you again. So there we go. That's everything we have on offer this month. Let me know what you purchased and if any of them were in common with mine. I do love this little pet though, it is very cute. I'm just wondering why we didn't get the Watcher of the Huntress though, since this seemed to be more of a green themed inventory or month at the trading post. But yeah, hopefully we'll see that sometime soon. Until then, hope you enjoyed the video. As usual, thanks for watching and I'll see you next time. Thanks guys! Ooh, I think I could use these!
Maybe my next generation mad. Oh, that glitter one is a nice one to finish on. Oh, I thought that was a treasure. I saw purple. That threw me off. Oh, you look absolutely oh, my inventory is fabulous. Full. I'm so jealous. Wait. Okay, so that means Yay. Okay. Um Yeah, let's half back. Oh, now I have another pet to level. But that's okay. Come see my wares. Okay, now to buy the mount. Oh, I just have enough. My tally is even lower than it was last month. Last month I ended up with 65. This month it's 15. <laughs> wow. <laughs> 